Hey everyone, this is Steve from OS Training, and if you were watching our channel earlier this week, you would have seen us introduce a plugin called Publish Press, which is a really useful plugin for WordPress teams to get organized, to customize their workflows, and to keep on top of a busy site. Publish Press is a fork of the popular but really pretty old plugin called EditFlow that's been around for many years now. So we took a look at the calendar, which is big and beautiful and allows you to organize your WordPress content in the previous video. And in this video, we're going to take a look at the notifications system in PublishPress, which allows you to keep on top of all the changes and everything that's being published on your site. So by default, PublishPress is going to arrive with two different notification workflows. One is going to be a notification every time when posts are saved. And also, you're going to get a notification every time an editorial comment is left. Now, we'll come to the editorial comments in a moment, but that's a feature of Publish Press which allows you to discuss every post before it's published. Let's take a look at notifying people when posts are saved. I'll click on Edit, and I'm going to get a variety of choices on the screen. On the left-hand side here, when to notify, I can get notified on certain actions. For example, I can get notified when the content is saved, when major changes have been added to the content. And if I want to, I can narrow down to only particular parts of the site. For example, maybe I only want to get notifications if a post is added, or Maybe if this is a site with WooCommerce installed and with shopping products, maybe I'm only interested in getting notifications when new products are saved. I can choose only to get notifications for content in certain categories, or perhaps only if content is changing from one status to another. Maybe I'm only interested in content which is moving from these particular statuses, it's moving to published. So in this particular in instance, I'm only going to get notified if the content is saved, if it is a WooCommerce product, and if it's moving from pitch or assigned or in progress or draft or pending review to actually be published. So basically I'm only getting notifications when new WooCommerce products are published on the site. In the middle, all I need to do is choose who gets notifications. The site administrator is checked by default. You can also choose to notify the authors of the content and you can drill down and choose specific users as well. And on the right hand side, you can actually control what is being shown in the notification. So in this case, the default is thank you for helping create great content with us. This is what goes in the email that people receive. and because we're doing WooCommerce products here, maybe I could change this to great e-commerce products. And there are some little short codes you can put in here as well. For example, this short code is the title of the content. This is the name of the person that saved the changes. Maybe the name of the person that published the content. And this is the URL so that people can click on it and go directly to the newly published post. Now, this is an example of the email you're going to get. It's completely customizable, but after a change was made on our site, I got a notification saying that changes were saved for test content. The name of the person that made the change is Steve, and I have a URL link immediately to click and go and see the changes. So these notifications are really super useful. If you have a busy site where things are happening all the time, you can set yourself up to get notifications and so you're on top of things. So we mentioned that you can get notifications when content is saved and also when an editorial comment is left. What is an editorial comment? Well, if you use Publish Press, underneath each and every post, there's going to be a editorial comment section where people can leave feedback. Say, hey, I think you need to add more content 
to the second paragraph. Do you agree? That's what an editorial comment is. And so people can have discussions underneath there. I'm replying to myself, it's a little circular, but I'm doing that so you can see how it works. There we go. So, Publish Press Notifications allows you to get updates when changes are saved to your content, when content is published. It allows you to get notified uh, or to choose who gets notified and it allows you to customize what's inside the notification. On the right hand side there's an overview of all the different kinds of short codes you can use in the notification. And you can also get notified when comments are left. So if you are the kind of team that has a discussion back and forth about posts before you make them live, then you're going to love Publish Press. If you're interested in finding out more about Publish Press, go to wordpress.org slash plugins slash Publish Press and you'll be able to download a free copy. And there's a demo link right there in the text. Click there and you'll get a free seven day demo of Publish Press with all the features. I hope you enjoy Publish Press and I hope you enjoy the OS training channel here. Click the subscribe button or leave a comment below and you'll be able to get updates on all sorts of great WordPress content and plugin reviews.